Yo, what is up guys? Zorin here with another Temtem Ranked video. And this time, we're going to be using a different team. We're actually going to be changing up the team. I said I was going to do two more videos, but I decided, you know what? The meta changed. The team's kind of outdated. I need a new team. I'm going to try this team out and see how it goes. And here is one of the Temtems that's going to be in the team. Just this Rykon over here. I trained it uh, yesterday and... Um, yeah, I'm just going to show you, go ahead and just show you the team while I'm at it. I was also um, doing some Luma hunting and I actually got pretty lucky this time. I, I've gotten got two Toxolotas and two Pookies, so my luck definitely changed over the course of the week. Uh, Monday to Wednesday, I was getting nothing and then I ended up getting these four from starting from Wednesday to, yeah, well, Friday. Um, I haven't gotten anything yet this uh, Saturday, uh, but you know, but anyways, Here's the team. The team is going to be my Inky is coming back. I am going to be using a uh, team with a bunch of neutrals and um, a lot of synergy that goes along with the neutrals. So there's going to be my Inky, which, you know, sparking bullet, obviously, for the neutral synergy. Nice electric mineral health, you know, just common stuff and just a f attacker. Um, we got Raikon here as well, you know, just basic basic stuff as well Catalonia, Hilda, Anger King's Roar there's really not much to talk about the moveset there's not much in Temtem where it comes to the movesets not a lot of Temtems have um, a lot of options so this is like the best option in my opinion for him you could go for Roar instead but I went for Held Anger just to give him an option and a little bit less of a stamina sink um, in case he can't hit something with Catalonia. Uh, Chansey here is my new, this is my actual new Kinu that I've had for a while now, just sitting there. Uh, we're going to be doing Revitalize, Resin Trap, Stonewall, and Better Burst because we're using Benefactor Kinu instead. And we're also using a more aggressive Kinu this time around. I mean, I did do it on my last team. I changed it at the end. But I think um, I'm going to keep trying to use that for this video. Um, but yeah, um, the thing is kind of glitching right now. Sorry about that. Uh, Chrissy, which is my Loali. My Loali is just Plague, Hypoxia, Gust, Risen, and Trep as well. This is just to cover against Earth Thames and Water Thames that are in the meta right now. Um, helps out a lot if there's any Toxic Thames as well. This thing can kind of like help out as well. We have Gust because um, it can trap things if we want to like really lock something down that can um, maybe Inky could take out or Golzi or the other. So it's really good synergy. I really like the uh, the trapping mechanic that it has here. And then we have Elyak here. Um, Elyak is the... Um, we're going to be using Cage, Held Anger, Goring, and Base Jump. We're using Cage and Hurry Wart because we're actually going to start using uh, uh, Cowler. Not Yowler. Cowler, just Cowler. I should really name his name to Cowler, but I named him Nerf Me because this was back when uh, I got him around when the level 72 cap was still going around. So he still has that, level, that speed one, so I probably need a new Yowler. I don't know if that one speed is needed anymore, so... But this is the yellow I had, and I don't really have the pan suns to buy another one. Especially because I'm going to be hosting a tournament soon. More on that um, later in the week. But yeah, we're doing show of Savage Suplex, Clinch, and Late Torment with Nutrition Bar and Comebacker still. Um, Late Torment because we're going to be using Cage, as you saw on Elyak. And Chrissy, well, has a trapping too, but it's mainly like if these two are together, we have Late Torment option. And we also have uh, Skunch here with Haido Uchi, Held Anger, Savage Suplex, and Perfect Jab. This guy's going to be the one mainly synergizing with the uh, Raikon and the Emperor. Because um, he should be going first. And Raikon and um, Emperor are both basically um, speed tuned. So they go um, like after Skunch does his Perfect Jabbing. And um, yeah, um, Slingshot as well. Um, we're using Taser on the Emperor because um, I kind of wanted to use it on him instead of the Golzi. Golzi usually runs it, but I'm, I'm going to be running it on Enki just see, to see how it goes. And of course, Bruce coming back from the other team, still holding out. He's going to be another Sparkling Blade and Hasty Lunge because we have Loali and Chansey. So that's the team here. We're using Channel Mail in case we run into Freeze teams. And we're using Bait as well on Bruce in case we run into Freeze teams because both of them can handle... Usually with Blumps and Oshira is just fine. So, yeah, that's the team. Uh, the team team will be in the description as always. If you want to try, like, just look at the team yourself and see if uh, you want to make any changes, maybe try it out yourselves. 
But yeah, this is going to be the team, and I'm going to go ahead and look up for a match. Thank you guys, as always. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like and subscribe as always. And I'll see you guys in the first match. Peace out. Until then. All right. First game of the night, because I'm doing this at night this time. And we're against a TTV, by the way. Um, all right. So he might be streaming, uh, so I'm going to get my ass kicked in front of the stream. All right, so we're going against a already a very heavy Earth team, as I thought it would happen. So I think here we're just—he's probably gonna ban, uh, you know, Calder. So, so what do I ban here? What do I want to ban here? Uh, that's a good question. Hmm. Maybe I ban the uh, the Gialis. I think I like seeing Gialis here. Uh, I do want to get rid of the Minotaur as well. Yeah, there's, there, there goes that. I already knew that I was leaving. I already knew that was going. But um, I still have my Recon. And... To deal with the uh, thing. But he's probably going to go... Oh, he's going double that? Okay. Uh, let's see. I think I'm going Recon here. I'm just banning his um his roller here. Yeah, that could work. Yeah, I'll go Raycon. Is he doing double Nitrosil? The scunch is gone. That's expected. I think I'm just banning roller here. Uh, Rolder or Size Munch? No, definitely, definitely older. And then I'll bring Inky. He's probably gonna be Size Munch, of course he is. I'm thinking of bringing, um... I don't think I bring... Yeah, I'll bring... I don't think I bring, um, Ozzy in this time. Uh, let's see how this team works out for me. I could see him switching. I don't, I don't think I don't see why he wouldn't. There's no way he doesn't bring. Um, I feel like Amphitheater works better here. No, no, definitely not. He definitely brings Minotaur. There's no reason to not bring. Uh, there's no reason to bring the Amphitheater, in my opinion. Not with the lineup that I have. I kind of wanted to ban it, but I didn't really have a choice here. All right, let's see how this goes. Okay. So I'm thinking... Who does he switch out? Does he switch out his normal or his... Does he... Does he prefer to keep his... Normal... His, that's, that's the tough part. You don't know which one he wants to bring out here. Thinking... I'm thinking I have to double switch here, no? No, double switching doesn't work here. I could just, um, beta burst into one and see what he switches into. Let's see what he does. Okay, so he did switch that one out. Into size munch, okay. I thought maybe he'd go for the mimic, but either one works. Wait, am I gonna kill here? Oh damn, we're too slow. Why is why is it why is it still so fast? It's a tank. That's that's crazy. That's crazy to me. I did really good damage though. Think the hyper aggressive is definitely showing its uh power. So now what does he bring? He probably brings out Goring Boy here, right? I don't think he brings out his Nidrasil. I'm thinking I just stay in and bring out the uh, Loali on the Raycon side. Right. I think that works pretty well. So here, he's just gonna like hasty lunge me, right? I don't see why he wouldn't hasty lunge me here. Does he go for a hasty lunch here? I 
because Ninja Cell, right? Do I do a double switch here? Into what though? Into Eliac? But then that, that's not really that useful for me, right? Uh, let's see. I kind of need Eliac too. Do I just sacrifice my... Thingamabob? Yeah, maybe I just go for the resin trap on this. I'll also just switching into Chrissy here. And see what happens. But I think I get hasty lunged here. And it probably it's probably running um what I think it's running. Yeah, it's running what I thought it was running. Yeah. It's running um that one that one thing that I always forget the name of. This is gonna hurt though. I am not very defensive. Oh that didn't hurt. Never mind. I thought that would hurt. But it did not hurt. Yeah, adrenaline shot, there it is. And now we can do is bring maybe we could bring bring our maybe we can bring back Raycon in actually. Hmm. Maybe we could bring out Raycon. I mean, her we work should bring out Cage, right? And I can cage it. Do I need my Mouflonk right now? Not really, right? Because I'll get hit by a black hole, right? Black hole is going to smash me if I, do, if I go into that. Uh. Mm, let's go back into Raycon here. I don't think he stays in though, right? But at the same time, what does he bring out? Um... Plague or rest and trap here. Well, plague would hit harder in terms of like, yeah, we'll, do, we'll go with that. Because I'm thinking, what does he switch in to take the Gretzelenyong if he decides to switch out? We're at plus two attack, that's gonna hit pretty hard. And he doesn't have another Earth move. Unless he's running Earthbreaker, then I'm kind of screwed here, but... I'm thinking... Am I really in a problem here? He goes into Muflank. That's good damage. I should have probably just swapped in, like, hit that slot. I did a lot. Pretty good damage. I'm thinking he probably just cages me in, right? He probably cages in. So there's no point in like swapping out because he definitely just cages me. It could be problematic. No lie, no lie. Mm. I think I'm still going to go for it. Go for another plague. I think a plague kills the. Uh... How strong is how how specially defensive is, um, Minotaur? That's a good question. Forty-four defense. Maybe I just go for the uh, plague on this. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, that's gonna hurt him so hard because I went for that play. Because um, oh yeah, that did a lot. That did really good damage. That's that's perfectly fine with me. We did already enough damage to not care anymore. Damn, that didn't that did not do what I was hoping for though. But now, pretty sure Elyak here just kind of like. Kills them. We have hurry work, so here we can just um, kill them both. Honestly, we're much faster than both of them now. 
I'm pretty sure Gorin kills 100% at 30%. There's no, there's, there's no way it doesn't kill. I think we're in a very good spot here. Raikon putting in work. By the way, uh, if you guys have a name for the Raikon, let me know. I was thinking of just naming it Ray, uh, which is Spanish for King. Because, you know, King, Lion, Lion King. So, let's not go with like Simba and Mufasa or anything like that. I don't want no Lion King name. Okay, I, I, I kind of want something else, you know? Okay. Nidrasil. That's really interesting. That's not really a bad thing. Pretty sure now I could just one tap the size munch if I really want to. Inky doesn't even have to come out. Like, yeah, uh, okay, Rio comes out. We're now in a really good spot. At least I think we are. We're at plus two speed. I don't want Rio dying. I don't think he dies anyway. Um, like I said, we could just um, just Quetzalenio this slot. Yeah, we could just put Solenio the slot and just base jump this slot. I think we're fine otherwise. It's just to protect him. Because I know he wants to um, stop the... Uh, the Raycon from just one-tapping me now. Like from, well, one tapping him, sorry. And yeah, now we're pretty good, in good spot. So we just switch out and we can just goring the, uh, the size munch here. And then we just win. I'm pretty sure goring kills. There's no way goring doesn't kill here. There's no way goring doesn't kill. Right on putting in a lot of work though. I didn't get to re really use Gaia, but I had to go on the offensive with Raycon here. I don't think he um he has any way of coming back from this. I really just have to switch out Raikon and preserve him and let um Inky just come in. Yeah. 30%. Definitely was gonna kill. All we had to do was protect our um our homie. Now we could just like kill this thing so gg very played well played this team is doing uh raycon put in a lot of work actually like he did a lot of work there and the held anger coming in let's go did it uh die okay there we go gg all right second match i almost clicked this button this team out of habit that would have been bad for the video, but whatever. Alright, so what do we have here? Looks like a interesting team here. So they're picking first. Um okay, goals is going away, that's okay. I'm thinking he probably wants to bring out the uh those hobies, so I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this. And I'm gonna thread in with the um with the Lowali. That seems like the best idea here. Honestly, the Wally kind of just mercs him. Not even gonna lie to you. It kind of just mercs him. What's stopping me from doing the Wally Kinu here? Uh, maybe the uh, the Volarin. Yeah, the Volarin probably. Kind of screws me here. 
Valorant definitely kind of screws me. Are you just bring Galder? I could do Yaller. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's do Yaller. I'm expecting Bowler in here. Bowler would make sense. If not, I ban it. He needs to bring it. Like, I, I, I'll ban it otherwise. Uh, let's see. I for sure probably can't bring my Recon. I kind of want to get rid of some of this stuff, so I think I want to get rid of his whip lump. Yeah, whip lump might be the, the play here, and I think he gets rid of my Inky. Right, Inky kind of just goes away after this, and I'll only have Ink my my neutrals to play with. Either Kino or Inky goes here. Yeah, okay. And now he doesn't need Sizar. Um Yeah, I don't see him needing Sizar here. Okay, he goes Sizar. I mean, I don't see his Electro Boy doing anything anyways, his Charger, so his Electric Charger really wouldn't do anything here. Now I'm here thinking, hmm, what do I do here? Do I switch L to maybe Elyak? I was pretty defensive, so I could bring Elyak out. But he could just double in on my, on my Yowler. I kind of need my my thing, so I think I am gonna do that. Let's switch out to Elyak here. Yeah, there's the nauseous. He's going straight for the safe play. Yeah, okay, that works for me. The drill impact. Oh, double then. Okay, that's completely fine with me. I need to get rid of that Volor Ren, like, no joke I do. I'm gonna go ahead and cage into a late torment on this side. Even if I lose my Oyak, at least I'll be able to take this out before anything. Yeah, that's gonna go down. I wonder if it's Strange Vest. Doesn't do too bad damage. And there goes the thing that threaded my entire my 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 little Chrissy, so we're good now. Um We could probably just we don't even need Chrissy yet. We can just bring Chansey in here. Tukai comes out. Bring in Chansey. Because why not? Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, I like torment again. Because why not? I don't really need to do anything else. It's kind of trapped in, anyways. Yeah, that's not gonna do too much to what's his face for benefactor. So the nutrition bar and that's gonna. Pretty much keep me up, nice and healthy. Get rid of the uh, roller, and you, and you wonder why Yinu Cowler is is broken, right? Like, look at this. This is just not fair. <laughs> this is just not fair. I can take out everything I want by doing that. That did a lot, though. But did how much did that do? A tornado might that all kill me, though. That's true. Tornado will kill, and that thing's faster than me too. One first. Oh no, I don't. There's definitely a tornado coming in. 
definitely a tornado coming in. So what do I do? Do I just switch out into Chrissy? Yeah, maybe I just switch into Chrissy here. And then just... Um, Savage suplex the... Uh, I think means Savage suplexing the... Um, Tukai here. I don't really need to worry too much about the um the sides are right now. I don't think I do. I know tornado's coming. Yeah, tornado's definitely coming. I should be able to take that pretty well on 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 the um. And now this thing's gonna take a lot of damage, putting it into a very bad spot. Okay. I'm <laughs> not even killed, honestly. Yeah, it didn't even kill. Um. Well, nerf, uh, nerf me is probably dead here, which is fine with me. I could just plague. Yep, there it is. GG, you know Calder, guys. You know Calder. All right. Well, there you have it. If that's not proof enough that, yeah, you know Calder is broken. What other proof do you need, Krema? Literally, I, I, I make really weird teams. I've been avoiding using Inu Cowler for like, since who knows how long it's been. I don't think I've ever used it in actual competitive battles. I had a, a, a Yowler for like a very long time, but um, I never actually used it in competitive. I ended up making a team with it and then never used it. Because um, I think, because it was the level seventy two cap, and right when I bought it, you guys nerfed it a little bit, so I decided to. Uh, I just ended up just leaving it there. That's why it's still the one speed melt variant. And look at it; it's it's not even like optimal for play right now. But then again, it's fifty. Oh no, you know what? I forgot. Right, ladder matchmaking makes it fifty, so it doesn't even matter, right? But you can see why. I'm always talking about the Yinu Kaler. I just brought them together. I literally brought Kinu and Yowler. And then I tr I literally trapped them with, with Yowler because I know I can tank all those hits. Murdered the, the, the Voloren. The only thing that was really going to like ruin my team. And Yowler, all Yowler had to do was take out one Temtem and it opened the whole thing for by Loali, so I don't know. I think I think Yowler needs to be looked at again, and I I, I I really think it's the Savage Suplex though. But anyways, as you saw, pretty pretty standard stuff with Yinu Kowler. You bring them in, you win. But I'm really liking the team. Raikon really did put in work on the first battle, and I was really really into it. I really I was really happy to, uh, with the results with my new Raikons because I specifically made this team. Because I got this Luma uh, Rikon during the Riber week we had like a month ago, it came like in an hour, and I and it came out with really good stats. So I haven't perfected it yet because I'm waiting for a reason to use the Furt uh, for 1.0, and then I'm gonna use the Furt. So this is this is really the reason why I made this team was for this Rikon. So the fact that it got to uh, be the star of the show. Well, the first um thing was really cool anyways guys thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed the video keep on the lookout for the uh, tournament video that i'm gonna make to see on the details on how that's gonna work i'm going to be broke as hell with this tournament but it's okay i just want to you know do something cool for the community because you know 1.0 guys there's gonna be so much stuff and don't forget that we're also uh, you're, uh, it's gonna also enhance my videos because we're going to be seeing emotes like me sitting on a chair or and also, it's gonna like make my thumbnails look cooler because of the poses. This is all gonna be super hype. So anyways guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!